back at it. Here we are again. We are in the garage. We are starting a project that I'm excited to start. It is the wide body on the Integra. It's gonna be a one-off custom wide body for the Integra. I, I wanna go wide body because I just like the way they look. I like the more aggressive and the, the vision I have for this car. I wanna go a really aggressive track inspired look to it. So we gotta go wide body and I like those wide wheels. Wide wheels just make things look so aggressive. So that's what we're gonna start today. It's gonna be a long drawn out process. There's gonna be a lot that goes into it. So I hope you guys are ready and I hope you stay tuned for the entire build. It's not gonna be days, it's not gonna be weeks. It's probably gonna take months and it's, it's, I'm taking my time, I'm making sure it's right. So I hope you guys are ready because I'm ready. So let's get into it. This is going to be the backing that everything mounts to on the fender. We'll work everything off of that. Um, yeah, I had to weld in because I, yeah, I had to weld that on because I actually changed the design of this like three or four times. So this is the final. This is the actual one that I like. Um, I'm not grinding away the welds because the welds are ugly. It was just a basic tack stitch weld onto it. I'm grinding them down to make them smooth because this is gonna be a cosmetics piece. It's not really a strength piece. Um, it's just cosmetic, that's what everything's gonna bolt to. All my welds on this are gonna be ground down flush. I'm welding front and backside. The backside welds will remain. The front side's welds will all get ground down and, and be flush and things like that. So don't worry if you see me using a grinder. It's not because my welds are ugly. It's just a basic tack stitch weld that I'm using onto it. So I'm gonna grind those down, make them flush. I'm gonna metal work everything after we're done onto it. This, but this is the, the first process that we're working on right now. I'm gonna go ahead and tack weld the, um, the overhang lip onto it and then just start getting everything ready to do all the other work. It's gonna be a short video today because I'm gonna be doing a lot of work just cutting metal, uh, welding metal, grinding, shaping it, and things like that. You're not gonna see a finished product today. You're gonna have to hold off for that, which means you're gonna have to subscribe. That means you're gonna have to like this video, hit that bell notification so when the next one comes, you won't miss it because we got a lot. And if you wanna see the final product of what we're working on here, subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell notification so you don't miss the next episode. Leave a comment and a like down below. But right now we're gonna get right back to this. We're just gonna tack weld the other part onto it. And I think that'll be all for you guys today. I'm gonna continue working. I got plenty to do. Um, yeah, so give me just a minute. <music>
Jeremiah 29:11 reads, For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord. Plans to prosper you, not to harm you. Plans to give you hope in the future. I feel like I'm living that plan out. I feel like the things that happen to us in life, they're not designed to stop us. They're designed to reposition us so we can come in contact with what God really has for us. And so everything that, that I do, man, I do it to honor God because I feel like God gave me a second chance at life. Hi, so I think that's all the welding I'm going to do right now with you guys watching because I got a ton more work to do and it's just going to be one of those things to where I'm just kind of hitting it, looking at it, hitting it, looking at it. So there's not too much more that I'm, I'm, I can explain to you guys. You know the, the, the project that we're working on. I just can't wait to find to finally see the 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 in process, the, the outcome of it. I'm excited about it. It's something I've been actually working on for probably six months in design alone, just design alone. And I've gone through, like I said, three or four different designs onto it. And I finally settled on one that I, I'm really happy with and I think will execute very nicely. Um, it's kind of inspired if you've actually looked at the renderings of the, the new Nissan Z400, when they did a renderings of the wide body, I kind of took that as inspiration because I really liked the way that the lines went on that. And we'll see, we'll see if it comes out. I mean, my cardboard templates that I did and my one fiberglass template that I did look pretty good. I mean, I tweaked and adjusted them from what I'm going with metal, but as of right now, this is what we got going. So it's gonna come and have a nice arch and flatten out right here and then have a big space. We're gonna try to arch it to where it kind of flares out this way. I don't know if any of this makes sense, but this is what it's gonna look like. It's gonna give us about an inch over. So that means wider wheels will be coming. I don't know soon. I don't know when, I hope soon, but I, I doubt it. Um, so the issue with the wheels on this thing is the, the four by 100 love pattern. They really don't have too many options of wheel styles that I like in that pattern and in the size that I want. I'm actually, right now I'm running a 17 by eight with a plus, plus 30 offset. I, I, I'm pretty sure it's a plus 30. It's either a plus 28 or a plus 30 offset. I'm running a five mil spacer in the front and an eight mil spacer in the rear just to get it pulled out for what it is. I'm wanting to go with the 17s because I love the way the 17s fill the, uh, the wheel gap with a 40 series tire. It's a medium enough tire. It's not rubber bands or anything. So it, I love that tire setup, but I want to go with a 17, probably by 17 by nine, maybe even a 10 with like a plus 20 offset and everything. So a nice little lip onto it. Um, I might have to go with like a, a two piece wheel just for that lug or upgrade to the five lug full pattern. But then I have to redo all the brakes again and, and I, don't, I don't know. So I've got my options out there. I don't know exactly what I'm doing. I haven't found what I wanted yet. So that's coming too. So if anybody out there has a set of 17 by nines or 17 by 10, uh, four by 100 bull pattern wheels that you're willing to let go or whatever, hey, let me know, comment down below and everything. Maybe we can work something out. But yeah, so wide body coming real soon for the Integra. I hope you guys stick around. I hope you guys enjoy the content. I hope you guys watch what we're doing here. Um, I'm excited. This is something that, like I said, it's been a long time making for me. It's all been up here in my head. Now I'm actually physically putting it down onto a material that I can work with, but it's gonna take time. It's gonna take a lot of time. It's gonna take uh, a lot of skills. Um, that I have and a lot of skills I don't have because I've never made body panels out of metal. I mean, I've welded and I've built mini trucks and everything. So I've welded up frames. I've welded on like wool pans and shaved door handles, but I've never scratch made a body panel. So this is exciting. This is a first for me. Hope you guys are excited. I hope you stick around for it because it's, it's, it's just something new. You just don't see it too much. So I'm excited. Here we go. I said excited a lot, but I'm super excited. And I hope you guys are too, because it's just something new and different. But I'm going to get back to this. You guys get back to your day. Build something. Do something that you love. I mean, we're, we, 
we all feel like we've been created for a reason and a purpose. Find that reason, find that purpose, and go out and do it, and your life will be so much happier. You'll feel so much better. So trust me, guys, on this one. We're all here for a reason. Let's not waste it. But I appreciate your time. Thank you for watching it from the bottom of my heart. Stay gold. Stay humble. Peace. In their games, just pick a lane and do your thing. I don't just want to be great. I'll be the best. Make everybody forget all the rest. Man, I feel